going on, y'all? Welcome back to the garage, and welcome to Free It Friday! Holy cheese and crackers, I almost missed out Free It Friday. I was busy outside doing the kicking, doing the grilling, and the relaxing, and I almost missed Free It Friday. Well, heck no, we're not going to miss it because I found one really cool thing the other day, and I found two really, really cool things in my own collection. Unopened, gotta see them. And, uh, yeah, so that being said, I got a lot of comments, and I appreciate y'all commenting. I really love the comments. If you would just make a comment, you know, anything, this sucks, I like the Porsche, I like, you know, I like your background, just anything. Just make a comment, because that's going to be very important in the very near future. Uh, but it sh you should always just be nice. If you're going to go in there, at least like the video before you watch it. And then, you know, make a comment if you really do like it. I don't know. I don't know how all this works. But I just know I get more views than likes. And I really want the likes. I just want y'all to know. I just want to know that I'm doing something right. So anyway, that being said. Let's move on. Uh, BFD. BFD Drives. Is a channel I want y'all to go check out. Uh, because uh, Sven is over in Germany and he does a lot of car shows and there are some amazing cars from Porsches, Opals, Audi, uh, American cars as well because there are a ton of American cars in Germany because of our, you know, military uh, occupation or, you know, visibility, bases, camps, whatever you want to call them. Um, so please go check out BFD Drives. Uh, Finn is a very cool guy. His videos are freaking awesome. So let's take a look at what I found. <sighs> Super excited about. Boom, boom, boom. Yep. Exotic Envy set. I didn't really care for any of these cars at all. Except that Porsche. Uh, the M1 Pro car is pretty cool because I do have a couple of them. McLaren F1. I've got it don't care for the other two but the Porsche y'all uh, in case you didn't know uh, I could like Porsches <laughs> so I was happy to find this one it was just like a random grocery store stop and super stoked to see it yep 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 I like it I like it a lot absolutely like it a lot so as I was going through things, you know, you if you saw the Bugatti video, I found out that I have a lot of Bugattis, and uh, I also found that I have some Porsches, and I double checked that I don't have inside the uh, Porsche collection. What is going on? Porsche 911 Cabriolet, fancy word for convertible, and this beautiful pearl white. Uh, what year was this made? Oh, so oh, okay, so this has been there for a while. Uh, 2020 Mattel, so 2021 release. Uh, this one's been inside that tote for a while. So it needed to come out. And I know it's horrible, and it's white. And it probably can't really make it out. I don't know. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know how to fix my lights, but happy to have it. I do have several of these Porsche Cabriolets. Right color interior, man. That thing is absolutely nice. Tail lights are done nice. Front end is done nice. Porsche emblem. Yeah, so super happy to have that one. I already had it. Didn't know it, but I got it. Let's go ahead and take that down because this is blinding me. Uh, and then this one. 2020 Porsche 911 Carrera 4S. In the moving parts. And I... A lot of people don't like this packaging, but you know what? I didn't see as many open packages of this one as I do with a new environmentally friendly one. Because... They seem to be stolen everywhere. And I double checked my collection. I do not have this open. Uh, very, very nicely done car. Yep, doors do open on both sides. I don't think y'all need to see them. Uh, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Uh, Porsche 911 though. You got to love it. It's one of my favorite cars. And I've had both of these sitting in my own collection for years. Didn't even know it. Didn't even know it. 
I just buy things and I say, oh, I think I got that. And I throw it in a box and I forget about it. And let's say, no, I buy five or ten more. <laughs> but luckily, these are the only two that I have come across in the last two weeks. And I'm um, happy to have these on here. Absolutely. And happy to have that sweet 911 right there. Yep. Porsche Jammer getting full. Uh, we're down to the last. You know what? Let's just go ahead and stop the video right here and let's add them. But, all, all right, and we're back. So, as you can see, uh, Porsche Jammer number two, we're almost full, y'all. So, let's go ahead and put this sweet 911 right there. Oh my god, I love that car. Let's go ahead and put the sweet red one right here and put this Cabriolet convertible right there so now we have five empty spots to completing Porsche Jammer number two wait a minute we forgot about this one they came out of that bag boom baby now we have four empty slots and the second Porsche Jammer will be finally completed and I bet you I got more Porsches inside that tote more totes I got she's oh, a cracker like eight or nine totes we're so far behind organizing but you know what uh, life is good and uh, it's good to have friends like y'all that have looked out for me and helped me out and uh, that has come here and like like this video made a comment and said hey I love the Porsches and you know what that fuels me because I like Porsches too <laughs> so anyway y'all that's all I got as always be safe be well and be kind Always be kind. Till the next time at the garage, I'll see you later, grease monkeys.